northeast Cambodia, a landscape formed by the Mekong River and its three tributaries, is one of the last strongholds for three critically endangered species of vulture. In this region, there remains one of the last significant stands of a unique type of dry, deciduous forest. These remote forests are home to many rare species that are now found almost nowhere else, such as the giant ibis, Cambodia's national bird, the white-shouldered ibis, and many other rare birds. Villagers here still practice traditional methods of livestock keeping, allowing their cows and buffaloes to range free in the forest. These form the main food source for the vultures, including the red-headed vulture, the Asian white-backed vulture, and the slender bill vulture. Our NGO, the Angkor Centre for Conservation of Biodiversity, or ACCB, has been running a vulture conservation project for many years to protect these vital and small populations of Cambodian vultures. Vultures breed during the dry season, producing just one chick per year, so we monitor and protect their nests. As well as this, we run an awareness campaign to discourage the use of poisons for hunting, one of the main threats to vultures. An important tool for vulture conservation is our monthly vulture restaurants. A vulture restaurant is when we provide a supplementary carcass for vultures to come and feed on. Not only does the extra food increase the vulture's ability to breed successfully, but it gives us the opportunity to count the vultures and estimate the population size. Vultures have a bad reputation in some countries, but the reality is that they clean the environment by quickly finding and removing dead and rotting carcasses. This helps stop the spread of disease. To see vultures gliding effortlessly on their enormous wings is truly to behold the masters of the skies. Please help us to protect vultures in whatever way, big or small, that you can.